Looks like we did it, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. We have ourselves our first Windows share. It took me 45 minutes to get this set up. I'm very proud and happy of this. I am so cool with it. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Tech Keytronics channel. We're going to be doing a little unboxing today. I'm going to start by unboxing a Synology RS 819. Okay, so let's see if our angle is right. Angle with a dangle. All right, it's the best angle I can do. <laughs> we have the mounts. And we have another mount. And have a power cable. We have keys. I don't know if you can see them. We have screws for the hard drive. As you can see, it's like 3.5 hard drive screws. Let's see if we get that to focus a little bit. Well, I can't get it to focus, but I'll just... It's a bunch of screws. And then you do it for 2.5 inch hard drive or 3.5 inch hard drives. Um, and we got some additional screws. These are unlabeled, so they're probably for what I would want to do. Um, so without further ado, I'm just going to do away with this and not really care about this because it's not uh, it's just a waste of space for this, it's for its purpose. Oh my. It ain't easy being cheesy, I would say. Alright, so but it's pretty cool. I mean there there we have it. This is the back of the unit. As you can see, it's got several fans. And we have the front of the unit. Which is going to be cool. So now I got to figure out how to get this all installed. So I'm going to stop. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, basically what I've got done is I've gotten it installed. Now the next steps are to plug it up and uh, get it turned on. And then I'll set up the shot for the uh, early portion where we set the stuff up. All right, so basically what we're looking at here is like what I was doing for storage was I was using my PowerEdge 710 to store data. 
But as you can see, these 2.5 inch drives, you're not going to get a lot to store on them. And for my biggest drives on it, I have like a, a gig, not a gig, but a terabyte. And that's just not enough. And um, so what I would like to do is maybe free this up for like Proxmox. And uh, we have the Synology NAS. I installed two four terabyte hard drives in phase one and two. Um, now the thing that's left to do is to plug it up and, you know, get it going. We, all right, so this is the uh, first time I'm loading it. So we're doing the setup, device setup. All right. We're going to install the disk manager. Yes. All right. So I'm kind of winging it as I go. It's it should be pretty simple to set up. All right, so I'll put up my email. Actually, uh, we'll skip this step. All right, so we're in. Okay, it's looking good. Yeah, why not? I acknowledge the statement. All right, so it's like a little operating system, which is really cool. Uh, All right, we'll just we'll just use the whole volume and use see if we could do like Okay, I'm just trying to uh huh.
All right, so we'll see what this volume does for us. Yes. Everybody gets read and write. So, say I wanted to share it. All right, so I know that. Okay, um, the security. I need to enter the password to connect to that. Username. Hey, I gotta enter my credentials. Looks like we did it, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. We have ourselves our first Windows share. It took me 45 minutes to get this set up. I'm very proud and happy of this. I am so cool with it. So we could repeat that action and use it again. So with that, ladies and gentlemen, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you aren't already subscribed. Be sure to click the like and share the video if you benefited from this. Thanks for watching.